All right, guys, I'm going to show you how to access the math map on CC Connected. So this has been something that a lot of people have struggled with, myself included, um, because it's moved around a lot and it's just kind of hard to find in my opinion. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So you need to log in to the Learning Center on CC Connected. And in order to be able to find all the levels of the math map, so digits, naturals, and fractions that are currently free and available for CC Connected families to download, you have to have paid your tuition for the upcoming 2024-2025 school year. If you haven't paid it yet, you're not going to be able to see this. But once you've paid, you'll be able to see this. So what you're going to do, log into the Learning Center, go to Foundations, go down here to Week 7, and you're going to want to find this Math Map Companion. So if you have only paid your enrollment fee and not your tuition, you can only see the first six weeks. So that's why this is buried under week seven. Once you pay your tuition, it unlocks week seven and on. And so they put stuff that they only want tuition paying people to have under week seven. But it's a little confusing because it makes more sense logically that it'd be under week one or week zero, the getting started week. Anyway, so here's the Math Map Companion. This is kind of like your starting point. I would click on this link right here and it's going to copy that to your clipboard and then save that in a note on your phone or wherever you save things that are you want to access easily bookmark it whatever but I save it to a note on my phone that way if I need to get to the math map companion I can just click that link and not have to click through several things to get in here so save your link there and then click on this. This is the math map companion. This is like the teacher guide kind of sort of for the math map. Um, it's all virtual. You cannot download this, but this is where you'll find the downloads for the lessons. So hover over this little corner and this works much better on a computer. Yes, it is accessible on your phone. You can do it, but it's really clunky and awkward and it doesn't work well on my phone. So I recommend a computer. Uh, so it's good. You click on that, open the page. It's going to open up this chart here, and this is where you're going to find your downloads. So pick the level that you want to download, digits, naturals, or fractions, and then go down the line, and it's going to highlight a number. So that's week one, week two, week three, and so on. So let's say you're going to click week two here, and it's going to open this. Scroll down and click here to download, and it's going to open up that week's lesson and so here is the lesson there's the cover page for that week here's the worksheets uh, remember this is the beta version so this is not um, everything that will be in there but then you can just save it to your computer and print it off so it is tedious but okay so then once you close that out click here to return to home page it will take you back to this page so it, it does take time you're gonna have to go through and click each one individually and download each one individually and then I put them in a file on my computer so I could find them later to print them so and I have kids and that'll be doing all three levels so I just went ahead and did all of them um, so that is how you print them and then it there is one option to print naturals all in one file so let me show you that so go back to the Learning Center and go up here to all categories and go down here to the math map beta and right here printable naturals lessons for adults and older students so this has all the naturals lessons four to a page instead of one per page so this is for it's older kids who like maybe you have a kid going into challenge a next year and you just want to quickly go through the naturals level with them so they get familiar with the layout and the terms but not actually doing like high level math this is going to have four lessons, one, two, three, four per page when you print this out. So they're going to be really small. I would not recommend this for a kid that is actually natural's age. I even tried printing two to a page for my third grader, um, and he said that was too small even for him. So we are just doing one page per page, so downloading each week like I showed you a second ago. But if by chance you want this for an older kids or for yourself, you can come here and this is all in one file. So you can just download this one document and it's going to have all the lessons in one and then you only have to print one thing. So that is nice. I wish the others were all in one document, but they're not. So here we are. So anyway, I hope that helps as far as finding the math map and downloading it, printing it, all that stuff.